Nick from Metal Gods TV and I am with Isaac from Epica. Brilliant. Are you looking forward to playing today? Oh yeah, it's been a while that we played the UK and uh, so it's it's uh, it's been three years I guess so it's good to be back and uh, to have a show so we don't really know what to expect but I, I hope it's gonna be a, a cool party. So. Are you happy with the slot that you've got to play? Oh yeah, I'm happy with whatever we get. Like I said, it's been a while so we, we don't really um, actually I don't what, what do we play five o'clock or something that that is okay for me I mean then I can hang out and see the other bands as well so that, that's good is there any bands that you're really hoping to see yourself oh I uh, I want to see Devil Driver and uh, I haven't seen Five Finger Death Punch so I want to check them out I've heard of them but I mean they're not really that big in Belgium where I come from so but I heard the name and I definitely want to check them out and uh, Napalm Death of course with a beer and all that stuff. So. See if you last that long, I mean, not, they're on really late, aren't they? Yeah, I know, I know, but I, I last pretty long. <laughs> yeah. And uh, are you promoting a new album at the moment? Are we? Are you promoting a new album? Yeah, yeah. Um, so we just we, we toured like basically from last October until now, and uh, we go on and on. But uh, with a European tour, we just got back last week from a US tour, Canada. Uh, in a month, we go to South America again. We also did. Uh, it's the second part now, and uh, so and now these are like single shows we do in, in Europe. Um, next week, a couple of Dutch dates. Then we go to Spain, Portugal. So I mean, it goes on and on, and that's really good. So the, the new album is doing really, really well. Actually, we got lots of good responses. Also, the US tour was extremely good, above expectations. So um, yeah, we can't complain. Yeah. What can people expect from an Epica show? Um, well, normally it's a, we because we flew here, we couldn't bring the whole production. Um, but you know, nor, normally they can like we have firework shows sometimes, but not today, uh, unfortunately. But um, so today, what can you expect? We're gonna play like as it's been a, quite a while. We're gonna play lots of like, of course, the new album, uh, but also the hits like uh, so uh, it's it's like the normal show that but it's not normally we do like lately we've only done headline shows so it's good I think to have a, a, like a support slot again just to see how that goes and um, so it's gonna be slightly shorter but uh, we, we just play all the, the, the hard songs we have I guess so. It's gonna be a, a regular Epica show, but just shorter and without all the, the fireworks or whatever, you know. So just a, a good metal show. And are you gonna get much chance to relax? Are you here for the weekend or just for the day? Well, we got in last night and uh, we leave early in the morning tomorrow. So that's too bad. But uh, you know, I, I hope we can come back like maybe after the summer uh, that we can do a, like a UK run. Uh, that will be really cool because um, you know it's not really good of us that we kind of ignored this area for a couple of years but you know that's just the way it went and uh, you can be everywhere at the same time but um, so hopefully we can come back to do like headline shows or something and uh, and then we can see the country and all that stuff but you know I, I've been here quite a lot also as a, as a kid in uh, England and uh, so uh, it's always good to be back, you know. And if it's for a show or just on holidays, it's a cool country. You've got good English anyway. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Maybe you can get on Hard Rock Hell in December here. Is that another festival? Or oh, yeah. Oh, really? Oh, well, if we do good today, maybe they'll ask us for that one. <laughs> I don't know. But, you know, there's also, uh, what, what's the other English big festival? Down with, yeah, well, these two, I guess. Yeah. But, you know, we'll see what happens today. Maybe they, they'll be like, who, who are you? You know, just stay home. <laughs> but, How do you like the festivals? Do you prefer festivals to doing your own headline? Uh, well, it's different. Like I said, like uh, it's good sometimes to be on a uh, festival that you're not... If you're only headlining, then you only play for your 
fan base and like you know it's it's always good to to play festivals like last year we did Wacken at the same uh, time that In Flames was playing so that is like a, a really good spot and lots of people see that and it's streamed on the internet and all that stuff so you get a lot of exposure um, like also um, to this this year we play ping pop in uh, in Holland which is like a very big main, uh, mainstream festival so that is really really good for us for the exposure it's not a metal festival so lots of people will be like who are you but you know we, we, we'll get uh, on TV with that and all that stuff so that's really good um, so you, you basically need the festivals even if it's not a metal festival but you need them to get the people to your show so uh, and I think it's a good thing you know it's like one big party you know everyone's there because they like metal if it's a metal festival and everyone is hanging out and having a good time and you check out bands and you I mean also as a band you, you, you go to festivals you check out other bands you meet your friends in other bands again it's like a, a big social thing you know and then you go back to your headline shows to that's really work then you know so then you have your work and your fans and all that stuff so it's also holidays for bands you know just play festivals hang out if it's nice weather that's a good bonus but you know so. The Hammerfest and the Hard Rock Hell ones because they've got a really this one's got a really good family atmosphere. You know the bands come off stage and go straight into oh, yeah. the crowd. And well, uh, that's what we even with the headline shows. I love to go like after the show or even before the show, go into the venue, check out the support bands or, or uh, just meet people, uh, look around. You know, you, you can sit in a backstage all day, but mostly they look like shit and there's nothing to do except for talking to your band members, which you see 24/7 already so uh, I just love to hang out with people uh, and they also appreciate that you know if you come out and you, you, you I mean we're not rock stars or something we just I just play guitar and I want to have a good time and uh, that that's about it and um, so you know also today I'll just hang out and, and uh, but I like that atmosphere you know sometimes you really have these bands who like oh you, you can't come close to them. Also on festivals, they're like totally away from all the other bands. And, I mean, it's good for them, but I, I'd be like, you know, I want to have a beer with other people and just hang out. You know, everyone decides for themselves. So. Thank you very much. No problem.